Hello again. So today I have my very first mystery box unboxing. And this is the spooky secret mystery box. It looks like this right here and it just came in the mail. And I am going to be unboxing everything right in front of the camera. This retails for $49 and I am super excited. A lot of people were wondering if it brings Halloween items or anything having to do with like Halloween because you know it's spooky um, and we're gonna see. Without further ado, I am going to get started. <laughs> it says special delivery color pop and this is all the stuff that it brings inside. All right, so I am gonna go ahead and get started with the first item. Okay, so, <laughs> okay, so the first item is this right here, and these are two hair clips, and they're from the Powerpuff Girls collection. All right, so these are the little hair clips that it brings, and they are super duper cute. It's the blue little girl. I never watched a Powerpuff Girls, so I'm not really sure. Okay, so next, we have this right here, and this is the Feather Effect Brow Pen. Pretty. So it's a brow pen, and it has the thinnest little line, and it's kind of like a felt tip. It's a felt tip, and it's like brown. It's brown. Let's see. Yep, brown. Okay. I think I might give this one to my mom. I think it will go with her better because she has blonde hair and I think it will look better on her brows than mine. Mine's are pretty dark. All right, next is the BFF liquid liner and this is in the shade The Hills so it should be like this shade right there. Okay, so this is what it looks like and that is so pretty. Definitely gonna be wearing this one. Okay, next. Okay, so next is Fresh Kiss, it says. Fresh Kiss in the shade Freshest. I guess it's a lipstick. So it looks like this, and it is actually a lip cream. And uh, this is the applicator. Doesn't smell like anything at all. I don't know why I smell everything. It has like a rose. So next is this little palette right here, and this is the Citrus Fizz Press Powder Palette. This is what it looks like. I'm gonna give this a try, but I feel like this would look great on my daughter. These are the type of shades that she usually likes. All right, so next is this right here, and this is a makeup sponge, and it's just like this. It is a peachy, color very very cute i feel like i've gotten this before no i've gotten this before but it, it wasn't from color pop it was actually from shein and it looked exactly like this okay so i think i'm gonna give that one away so next is this right here and this is the twitter padded Lux gloss trio and it brings the shades bar bambi i was gonna say barbie okay bambi flower and thumper and I suppose this was from the um, Bambi collection. So it comes out like this. Super duper cute packaging, by the way. I feel like it's like extra because, you know, it has like this sleeve on top, although it doesn't need it. Okay. So this one is right here. Thumper. It's a light pink shade. Then we have this one, which is Bambi. And it is this fawn shade makes sense looks like bambi <laughs> then we have this one right here and this is flower and of course it's going to remind of us it's going to remind us of the little skunk flower because she likes flowers i haven't watched that movie in forever but i do remember really liking that movie i think that it was like sad at the beginning everybody knows that <laughs> okay next so next we have the lizzie mcguire so juicy plumping gloss and this is what it looks like 
By the way, I don't have any of these. This isn't the shade Lizzie, I suppose. It says Lizzie on it. Okay, and it is just a clear gloss like this. It smells like bubble gum. I feel like this will be something my daughter would wear or my niece. We'll see. <laughs> I think she liked Lizzie McGuire growing up. It is a very, very thick consistency. It does have a little bit of tingling, but it feels more like minty than anything else. But it does smell like, it tastes sweet and it smells like bubble gum. Next, um, we have some eyelashes and these are the falsies faux lashes and this is in the style queenie it says one pair oh of faux lashes they look like this they are so long oh my god i have never worn something so long i am not going to try them on because i feel like they are not the lashes that i would normally wear I don't want to just like put them on just to show you. i rather um, give them to somebody that is actually going to use them. And so that's why I am not going to be putting them on. Okay, so next is the So Dangerous, So Iconic Cream Luxe Lipstick. Oh my, Lippy Pencil. So I suppose it's uh, two things. So this is a lip duo and it brings the lipstick and this ooh, this is pink look at that it's a beautiful pink shade it's definitely something that's right up my alley love pink and this is the lipstick ooh. i've been looking for like a hot pink lipstick next is this right here and this is the glitterly obsessed body glitter it brings 15 grams or 0.53 ounces it comes in a little pot i'm literally obsessed <laughs> oh my gosh this is so cute look at this body glitter like i usually don't wear body glitter but i will make an exception for this this is so pretty and it looks like this you can see it has like that golden sort of um, look to it. So a couple months ago, I got the one and done collection. Is that what it's called? I think that's what it's called. One and done collection. And um, I had a body glitter, but it was more like body oil, glittery body oil. And I remember that I was, I was putting it on because it made my skin look so pretty and like so glittery, but like subtly glittery that I loved it. And I hadn't realized that it was actually making me itchy because I remember like just feeling itchy sometimes. I was like, why am I getting itchy? And it's only certain times, like sometimes. And then I realized it was every time I was using that. And I was using it like on my shoulders, like right here and on my arms and like in this area and that's where i was itchy <laughs> i hadn't noticed so i was getting itchy with that so i hope that this doesn't make me itchy because it's so cute all right oh my gosh you guys are gonna love this actually <laughs> let me oh my god <laughs> okay two things that i've been wanting okay it's actually palettes it's palettes yes guys there's palettes in here Okay, so the first one is the Disney Hocus Pocus Witching Hour Press Powder Palette. I had just seen a review on this, and this is, I think, from last year. Um, yeah, I think this is from the one from last year or for one of these years, not from this year. But definitely, it's a, it's a Halloween item. Oh, my gosh. I saw a comparison video with the one from this year and I thought that this was so cute. So look at these colors. They're so nice. Oh my gosh. So I am definitely going to be doing a um, 
five look video with this because I think that it's super cute. So yeah, usually don't get like these type of palettes and these boxes, mystery boxes. And the last item is another eyeshadow palette and I am super excited. And it's this eyeshadow palette right here is the plush like me eyeshadow palette. And I've been wanting this eyeshadow palette because I also saw it on a comparison video and I thought that it was like super duper cute. On top of that, look at this packaging. Oh my gosh, I'm in love. I'm in love. Oh my gosh, it's actually velvety. I'm in love with this. Like I am so in love with this. <laughs> Just the packaging, I haven't even looked at the inside yet. Oh, oh my gosh, yes, I love it. Look at this. Look at these shades right here. Ugh, so pretty. I'm also gonna be doing a five look video with this eyeshadow palette because this is like super, super cute. All right, so I think that's it, yeah, okay. Like I said before, this is the first time that I do a mystery box unboxing video from ColourPop, from anything really. And I am in love. Like I am so surprised. Uh, there was a lot of people I was seeing in the comments that were saying that um, there was two things, there was like two common themes in the comment section of the Instagram from ColourPop. The first thing was, it, is this a Halloween's products box? And the second thing is like, please don't give us a whole bunch of body care items. And actually there's no body care items at all in this, in this box. So, I mean, I was hoping for something from body care because I don't have any of the fourth ray stuff. Like I don't have any body care items from ColourPop, but I'm still very, very happy with this box. I said before, like, I'm going to be giving some of these away to my, um, my daughter, my mom, my sister, probably Christmas gifts. <laughs> I'm gonna be keeping some of these and um, super excited. So let me know in the comments down below, did you pick up this box? Uh, what do you think of all these things? And which one was your favorite item or what were you most surprised about? Thanks for watching, have a great day and stay safe out there, bye.